Hi guys, welcome back. Just a quick update. Um, I watched the video about the other day and uh, I think we were probably being a little bit fast in our production. Maybe didn't give you some of the content. We showed you the, the flight's absolutely raw. It's good to see that sometimes, but when I swapped the ESCs out on my motors, uh, on my tricops, sorry, I did say, oh, it's flying lovely and I'm watching it fly and I'm thinking that is not flying lovely. You know, I was all over that. But that settings uh, were for the turn of G plushes on the KK2. So, um, I've reset the KK2 basically, done nothing to it other than the normal calibrations that you have to do to make it work, um, and it is flying a little bit better, and we'll chop in some footage of that now for you. Yeah, so um, the, the Titan itself is a wonderful kit. Um, the, um, I've had a few little knocks along the way, the fact that the arms ping back obviously left enough slack on the cables, that's important to do if you're planning on crashing it. Um, well, none, not many crashes are planned, are they? But um, I certainly had a few issues along the way. Unscheduled landings. Unscheduled landings, yeah. <laughs> Luckily, because of the frame on the Titan, they didn't cost me any money. Um, just a case of picking it up, cleaning a bit of mud off of it, and uh, putting it back in the air. But really impressed with the powertrain and the Titan. I don't think there's anything I'd change on that kit, as it is. So, um, thanks for tuning in, guys.